As fans of Laker hockey, I'm sure you know what goes on here on a Saturday night after a big win. They sound the horn, the players gather in the middle, and victory t-shirts are thrown out to fans. However, as practice wraps up here at Taffy Able Arena, I had the chance to talk to the team to get a little bit of insight on some other traditions that maybe not everybody knows about. We'll explore three traditions of Laker hockey that are funny, interesting, and depict the history behind Laker hockey. The first tradition of Laker hockey that we'll look at is a shootout game called Apple Onion that the team plays every Thursday of a homestand weekend. Yeah, I definitely look forward to, to doing it every Thursday. It's, uh, it's fun and it gets us ready for the weekend. Everyone has laughs and, you know, make fun of each other and it's just, you know, it's, it's good, you know, it's good to be relaxed before a, a big Friday game. Not only is this a good opportunity for the Lakers to relax and have a little fun, but also a way for the goalies and players to work on those moves they use in those nerve-wrenching Saturday night shootouts. Now, here are the winner and the loser of Apple Onion to explain to you just how the tradition works. Uh, there's the first round, all the guys that score go on one side, all the guys that miss go on the other side. Um, and once that's over, the guys that score play off to see who the winner is. And then once you find a winner, uh, he gets a championship belt and an apple. And then the losers, the guys that missed go, and they play off till they have six rounds to score a goal. And if they don't, they have to eat the onion, which is terrible. Um, this is my second time losing this year, and I did win one time at the beginning of the year. But other than that, uh, I don't know, only two losses, I'm okay with that. Uh, I felt like I was gonna throw up today. Normally our trainer, Scott, has a, has a bunch of gum there and try to get the taste out of our mouth, but it wasn't there today, so I probably have onion breath right now. <laughs> you think you like onions, you don't like this kind. The apple definitely tastes a lot better than the onion, and uh, you know, it feels, feels good to win, so. The next Laker hockey tradition takes place inside the locker room. This custom has been honored for years, for as long as many Lakers can even remember. The tradition of the anchor in the locker room is one that is truly taken to heart. Well, the uh, anchor that we have uh, in the middle of the locker room, um, it's kind of like a symbol of like our team and uh, the respect for like the tradition of everyone who's played here and everyone who's playing here now. Um, a lot of the times we'll talk about like do things for the team and do things for the crest rather than for ourselves or individually. So that's why we have it in the middle here and um, we take it pretty seriously. Uh, no one can step on it and that's why it's kind of a... Uh, its own different color right there, and um, it's a pretty serious, pretty serious issue. If someone steps on it or drops anything on it, it's a $50 fine if anyone touches the thing. So um, the guys take it pretty seriously in the middle of the room. I don't think anyone stepped on it this year. The $50 fine is a pretty, uh, pretty big deterrent to stay away from it. Now, this last tradition is an undeniable favorite among both Laker fans and players: the superior Laker hockey tradition, the victory bell. After we win a game, obviously everyone's very excited and happy and then the best feeling in the world is getting to run out and see all the fans that came out to cheer for you that night and how happy they were that we were able to pull off a victory and they're all clapping and cheering and, and little kids are giving you high fives as we run out to the victory bell and it's freezing cold and, and it's just an awesome feeling, it never gets old. Uh, definitely ringing the bell is one of the best experiences at Lake State. Um, it only happens after a, a home win. So uh, it's pretty exciting, you know, all the fans are out there and, uh, you know, obviously in the winter it gets really cold, but we have our equipment on and, you know, it's just a fun experience. Your adrenaline is still going, so I guess the cold doesn't play that much of a factor. So it's, uh, you know, it's a really great feeling. My favorite tradition here at uh, Lake State is by and far the, uh, the victory bell after home wins here. Um, there's no better feeling than Obviously out on the ice, it's a great feeling jumping out on the ice and getting together with the team and celebrating a win after. But, uh, and even like raising the stick as the horn goes at the end and tossing the t-shirts and everything. But running out to the victory bell and seeing everyone kind of sticking around and seeing how much people actually do care and seeing all them out there and kind of just running through the tunnel of people and ringing the bell and seeing how excited people get, that's definitely the best tradition we have here. With hockey being so prominent at Lake State, tradition is a huge part of the program's culture. Players give credit to coaches, fans, and community members for helping to preserve these traditions. Our coach loves all our little traditions like the apple onion and, and um, juice boy and stuff that we do after practice and everything. And I think he's a big part in keeping those traditions around because he's really involved in the community. So, you know, he, he loves those things and he passes them on to everyone that likes our team and everyone that he talks to and all the fans. And, and each year he's always involved with some of that stuff during practice too. Students coming out to games and supporting the other athletes, I think it's a, 
it's something that you have like a kind of more tight knit community that I don't know. It's kind of it stays together more than you would if you have a campus of like 45,000 kids. It's really nice when you're playing in the games too, because you look up in the stands and you see all your friends and classmates, and it just makes more of that family environment. Come out and support your Lakers and witness the tradition behind Laker hockey. Thank <laughs> you.